All right, Chef Logan, back on the grill. Take a look. Welcome back, everybody. Now, we've had the grill. Our chicken's been cooking. You can see it's been getting really nice. Kind of really good. You can smell it. It's just, ah, oh, smell those toasting of the spices, just the whole thing. Our chickpeas, um, they've been doing good. They've been chilling out, you know. Nothing too spicy going on there. I really love it. I really love grilling. Just see the smoke giving off all, all that great flavor. Oh, amazing. The chickpeas are still looking good. I'm gonna hit them with a little bit more seasoning. Let's see. Gonna give them a little bit more seasoning. Give the chicken a little bit more seasoning. You know. Our side's looking phenomenal. Our chicken. Looking good. These are just some sweet peppers I got in a bag. They're really delicious. You can just throw them on the grill there. Um, just really quick. I'm putting them on right about now because I don't want them to get too mushy. That's one of the things about grilled peppers and grilled vegetables in general is that they can get really, really mushy. My grill is really fancy. I have one of the Heston Aspire grills. It has this like little sear burner over here that I'm playing with. This is the first time cooking on it, so I'm really hyped. And don't really be afraid to put anything on the top rack. It is going to be very hot, but um, I'm just keeping it up there to stay warm because I really do not like cold, squishy grilled vegetables. That's just terrible. Anyway. Oh. Oh, that, that's perfect. You can see the char. You can see how it's still tender. You can see it's dripping with juices and flavor. That is what you are looking for. Gonna hit our chicken with a little bit more salt and a little bit of seasoning right at the end really can help solidify that flavor. I'm gonna take this piece. Oh. <laughs> no worries, it's grilling. Everything's good. And I'm gonna take our pepper, plate it up here. Flash on there. And then I'm going to hit it with a little bit of herbs. Now I have a little tower of herbs over here, and uh, this is a great time to add a little bit of cilantro to it. Really adds an amazing flavor. Boom. It's just phenomenal. Amazing. This is what I live for as a chef and as a grill master. I hope you enjoyed cooking with me and have some amazing time cooking with your family. I'll catch you on the flip side. Bye.